We got this on lock. What is up, boys and girls, and welcome back. It's Albert, like always, here on YouTube.com slash GreenAppleBite with some more Smite content for you guys. Today, we're playing Afro in the solo lane. All right. I got this. And by I got this, I mean I have no idea what I'm doing. Um, now, Afro, I would say that she she excels a little bit more in the solo lane just because you, got, you have that nice mana buff. She could heal for days. And um, you could really just uh, start building stacks. I'm going to build into Warlock. Um, who the hell are they talking about? Um, there, is no such thing as too many there you go. Okay, I think they're talking about Afros. Yep, they're talking about me. Alright. <laughs> Alright, this Kumba is uh, being kind of... Uh, being kind of weird all right well anyways um i like her in the solo lane just because she has a mana buff you heal for days you're able to sack a lot quicker and aside from that like she's not the most potent god um and because of that you don't want to be stuck in the middle because ganks are real and they hurt especially as afro who has no escape basically except for her ult if you want to call that um if you want to call that a, a an escape um, I wouldn't, personally. There you go. Let's heal, uh, that... That Merc. Okay. And we'll go and head... We'll go ahead and head over here. Alright, good. We'll heal up Merc. And, uh, we'll start clearing again. So, as you can see, I'm going to bun rush um, Warlocks. Warlocks is a super high stacking item with, uh, oops, with 11 to, uh, st you know, actually get up to. I mean, not 11, 100. And, uh, and because it's 100, um, you want to definitely stack early. All right, let's see if maybe we could damage this. Or maybe we could get this. I think it might be done already. Nope. All right. Cool. Not only did we not get them or get any of them, but we also are losing in lane presence, really. There we go. All right. Back up. All right. So I'm going to be going into my three right off the bat just because it's going to be able to heal more. And I will be able to uh, clear a little bit more effectively as well. Um, let's go ahead and do that. Back up, man. And these minions need to just get off of me. Alright. And you can see that he is a, a little bit ahead of me. That's fine. There we go. We'll go into our one. Now our one is going to be able to stun him, which is fantastic. And... Honestly, I don't really have to worry too much. Go over here. Um, because I do have heals for days. There we go. Alright. The archers are attacking me for whatever reason. Don't like it. Back up. Alright. Want to back up. Don't really want to get into that. We'll use a healing potion. Um, and we're not going to use R3 to clear this little wave. Uh, we're going to save it to actually be able to... Um... There we go. There we go. Mm. Hmm. That sucks. It happens, though. Um, yeah, like I said, I'm not going to be able to out-damage uh, John Kui, unfortunately. Um, so I'm going to have to play it safe early on. I'm, I really gonna need to get my stacks going. Um, he is also going to Golden um, or into Warlock, so he's going to be getting really bulky as well. I think my second item might actually be like a, maybe a Borak. All right, he did get teleport, so I have no idea where he is. If he went back, then he's definitely not here, obviously. 
Um, but we will get some lane presence. Yes. Thanks to the fact that he is not here. Um, but there he is. Alright, cool. There we go. Alright. There we go. Did some damage. Not a lot, as you could, as you could tell. Um, is he, he's stacking already. That sucks. Um, I would love to start stacking, but I don't have my teleport up. Um, enemies might be incoming or they might just have dropped the buff. Either way. There we go. And he does have a heal as well, which sucks because basically all the damage I'm going to do um is just he's just gonna regain it back really uh let's go ahead and do this okay oh well hmm there you go just back up all right mm. my bird should be able to take care of most of that um i did run out of mana, which kind of sucks, but I should have mana pretty or back pretty soon. And like I said, it kind of sucks I'm not stacking at this point. Um, it also sucks. I'm actually going to play a little bit safe here. We don't have enough mana to really um, engage. That's nice. That's nice. Get, get off of me. Back up. Just relax, man. No trouble here. He's trying to basically zone off so that way I won't get experience from the minions. But it's not going to really work. Mm, we'll go ahead and clear one more wave. Mm. Ow. Okay, whatever. That's fine. I didn't think he would kill me there. All right, it sucks. I'm gonna have to take the early loss here, um, and just try to recuperate it. Uh, this John Kui is about a level ahead of me. Um, yeah, about he's level nine already. I'm level eight, but it's, it's totally okay. Um, there's no need to worry, basically. Um, at this point, we we need to focus on stacking. We need to focus on clearing. We need to focus on. Um, I'm doing a couple other things. Uh, we haven't been ganked yet, which has been really nice. So I can't really blame um, my team not helping me. Uh, you know, being ganked by the jungler and kind of losing in lane because the jungler um, has done that. All right. When did I upgrade my, my one? Hmm. Back up. Alright, cool. You want to do this? Nice. Just back up, man. There you go. No problem. We're going to stack. Nice and lovely. Nice and beautiful stacks. There you go. Hmm, yeah, just... Hmm. Alright. And at this point... Unfortunately, we can't really re-engage. His ult is down. But, uh, at the same time... Back up. Okay, cool. Hmm. So if you're gonna attack, you should you should do that right now. Hmm. All right, there we go. And this John Kui. There we go. All right. And just like that, we uh, were able to. Whoa, that was a lot of lag. Um. Oh, he's going over there. All right, cool. Actually, you know what? I'm out of mana. Let's go back. Um, let's go ahead and get uh, Shoes of Focus. 
Okay, fine. Whatever. Thank you. Be right back. Um, let's go ahead and get Shoes of Focus online. That way we have extra CDR. We'll be able to blast off our abilities more. Let's go ahead and get another ward. And let's go back off to base. So yeah, like I was saying, the only thing to Aphrodite, she has a healing. She has a sustainability in solo. The only thing she's missing is an escape. Um, John Kui with his ult, which is an offensive ult, is able to out damage me, whose my ult is used for, is, is used basically as an Aegis. So, just in terms of damage, he's going to out damage me. And like I said, I'm just going to have to deal with that. Um, the thing I can do is once we start team fighting, once we get out of the laning phase, I could heal my team more. Um, I could be a little bit more of a support role. Alright, I see he's there. There we go. And... Yeah, we, we just gotta keep stacking, man. Keep stacking. There we go. Whatever. Whatever. Alright, we're good. You're done. Man. I mean, what was I supposed to do there? <laughs> Alright. Sure. Why not? I got a kill. I actually have two kills. When did I get a second kill? Or did I kill both of them? I have no idea. Um, I don't know what that John Quee was thinking. He definitely messed up as soon as he uh, kind of... Uh, jumped into my tower and took a bunch of tower damage. There's no need to do that, really. Um, and my team is pretty much on point. Like, I really can't complain. Uh, I guess we'll go into Rod. Oh, we should probably get another. Um, we're going to get Sprint since we don't have an escape. It will provide us some sort of escape. We'll pop it, get away from the fight, and kind of retreat. Um, yeah, but the Silos rotated twice really nicely. And, um, aside from that, obviously Merc rotated on that last one, even though that, that Nija was, was basically dead. There's, there's no two buts or ifs about it. Sup? Sup? Sup, man? Alright, cool. So we'll do this. We'll do some of that. There you go. All right, we're good. No problem. No problem. We'll just keep hitting our basics. Oh man, that, those little stutters. I'm not sure what the hell is up with that. All right, we're good. All right. Oh man. Oh God. All right, let's heal up. We're good. We're good, man. We're all nice and yummy. Nice and yummy? Okay. Hmm. I'll Not sure I'm, I, I know exactly what I'm saying here. Um. Hmm. Seems to be coming after me. Eh, whatever. Alright, we're good. Like I said, just gotta play a little bit passively. Um, I am out leveling him at this point, and I do seem to have a little bit more mana. He also has blasted off his ult, which means he's not necessarily the most threatening thing. In existence right now. Hmm. All right. Well, you're fine. Yeah. Back up. And I basically healed all that up. Um. Now we are halfway stacked through our um, warlocks, which is nice. All right. There we go. Oh. Hmm. I'm out of, um... I'm out of mana, more or less. Hmm. Nope. Nope. Oh, God. Oh, God. All right. Scylla, you got that. You got that, Scylla. 
God! Hmm. That sucks. <laughs> I thought I had that. Didn't have it. I forgot he has his sash and that gives him a little bit of range. Just, you know, little, little slip-ups. Um, at this point, we want to get Rod online. That sucks. Um, that'll be that'll give us a ability to um, just heal really well. Come on, Uyer, you got that? No, you should retreat. You took a lot of damage. And yeah, you can see there from Nijon, man. He's probably building into some sort of crits. Yeah, he has. He's building into a uh, wind demon, which will definitely help him. Just kind of burst me down, to be honest. Um, and like I said, it was it was my fault. Uh, I shouldn't have engaged there. I should have backed up. There we go. Alright, we're fine. Okay, and he warded. Relax. Relax, bud. We're fine. We're totally fine. Alright, we just need to get out of the laning phase. That's basically all we have to do. Can you stop? Okay, well. Hmm. Oh, God. Oh, that heal right at the end. Woo! <laughs> Alright, cool. Um, was able to live. Thanks to my birds. My birds healed me right in the nick of time. Holy crap, alright. Hmm. Alright, so basically this Merc is freaking destroying at this point. Uh, Uyur, he's teetering off a little bit. Scylla, she's doing fantastic as well. And Kumba's doing great. Man, this freaking Merc. Amazing. Alright, he probably took my buff. Big deal. I don't really need it at this point. Alright, and let's go here and we'll clear. We have good clear. No need to worry about that. And, uh... All right, um, we're not gonna go ahead and um, aggress his his buff, just cause yeah, he probably he probably grabbed it for himself, which is a smart thing to do. Obviously, hmm, he has no mana. I'm guessing he's gonna back up at any point now, and as soon as he does, we'll push up that tower and we'll do some sort of damage. Now I didn't get any wards, unfortunately. Um. There we go. Yeah, you can see that my three does no damage. I seriously took <laughs> maybe like a tenth of his health, if that. And aside from that, he just healed it all up in any way. So, um, let's go into our ult. Alright. Well, we let, we let them know at the very least. It seems like... Okay. Alright. We're fine. We're fine. That's nice. Back up. Back up, homie. Alright. No problem, man. Like I said, my team, my team is doing really damn well. Holy crap, I love them. I love them so much. Especially this Merc, man. He's holding... He's holding the whole team on his shoulders at this point. Um, we'll do that. That'll allow us to push this tower. And we should be able to take this tower. Um, okay, well. You know everything I said before? No, not, not a thing. Hmm. Mm. Hmm. Hmm. Nice. Good job, Merc. Baby, you're a firework. Which is basically like saying... It's basically Katy Perry. The diva skin is really awesome like that. There we go. 
let's uh oh man get him nope seems like that is a big nope and that sucks um i really wanted that ymir um at this point i want to aggress on that tower yet i'm kind of stuck in between them so we'll go ahead and kind of proxy one wave like so uh we'll walk through this one not really a big deal um actually and we'll we'll head back we'll head back we'll get this we have a lot of are you kidding me <laughs> minions minions op man there we go all right we're gonna go back um at this point we're gonna start building some protections we're actually gonna go into oh wait should probably finish this there we go then we'll go into borak um borak will allow us to basically not take as much damage from this uh john kui which is awesome. Um, aside from that, it, the passive is also really awesome. When you drop below, what is it, like 35% health, you'll be able to get a small shield. Fantastic. That's nice, man. I'm not scared of you anymore. <laughs> and you're going to get destroyed by this merc anyways. There you go. And clear. Just like that. Not bad. Um, we do have enough for Borak now, but we just finished getting back from... Uh, we just finished getting back from um, our base, so we're not going to go ahead and grab it. Instead, we'll try to aggress on this tower. And you can see that I'm basically just healing everything. Oh, man. I thought I had that. There you go. Hmm. Let's see. Come here. Nope. There you go. Okay. Alright. There we go. And we'll clear that. No problem. No problem. There we go. And I'm basically tanking all this damage here. Alright, let's heal our, our team. Like we just did. Nice. Okay. Well. We're good. Hmm. There we go. Wait. There we go. Healing for days. Alright. Seems like we're going for Fire Giant, which is nice. And we should be able to get this. Um, Scylla kind of scares me, but at the same time, I mean, how would Scylla not scare me, really? Alright, we're going to back up. Okay. There you go. Hmm. I'm gonna back off of that. Um, we have more than enough people there, so I don't feel too bad. Um, now the thing we need to go into is... What should we go into? Uh, da, 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 da. You can see how prepared I was for this. Um, I'm actually gonna go ahead and grab... Gem of Isa wouldn't be that bad. Actually, I'm going for jungle bus. maybe a something that gives me a little bit of HP and uh, physical protection is what I'm guessing. We have one, two. No, that wouldn't work. Uh, maybe. Nope. Um, hmm. It's kind of hard. You know what? We'll go into ethereal staff. Why not? A more offensive item. It'll give me the health. I am, I do have a lot of health. I'm almost over 3,000, and um, it'll help me scale with my health. My damage, that is. Can you not? Um, that sucks. That Merc got caught out a little bit too much and ended up dying. Triple ulted, man. Feels bad. Feels real bad. Alright, let's go ahead and ward. Ward a little bit more aggressively uh, than we normally would. We'll do that. Um, we'll go ahead and help this Ooyer. 
There we go. We'll heal him. Um, and we'll continue to go... Okay, just follow him. Don't stray too far, my darling. There we go. You're basically fully healed. Now we can go to town on this... There we go. There you go. Now I have some damage. I have protections. I have the healing. And Aphrodite, as much as I love her, she's not a carry god. She's not a Scylla who could output damage. A Zeus. A Poseidon. She is a support god, uh, more or less. In my opinion. To make the most out of her, I think she, she falls more into support. There we go. Scylla, let me heal you, baby. Hmm. God damn, I, tr I tried. There we go. Hmm. We're good. I tried to give that uh, Scylla that um, invulnerability. But, obviously, I couldn't. There we go. Hmm. Okay, we should probably get the hell out of here. Alright. Oh, Mr. Axe, man. Feels bad. There we go. You're nice and healed. Very nice. Uh, we should probably yeah let's go attack left lane at this point we need to get all the towers down then we'll prioritize getting a phoenix he's probably gonna jump over how did you miss that axe man i'm sorry but how did you miss that there we go good that John Kui has so much health. Hmm. Okay, well, we're backing up. Oh no, Uyer! Hmm, we need to get that. We need to get that. That's nice. Nice! All right. Oh God, Merc, be careful! <laughs> this Merc, holy crap! This Merc is just murking everyone. This this Ymir has no chance against that Merc. I'm sorry, man. You messed up <laughs> really damn bad. Um, we're not gonna attack the Fire Giant just because it's just too far, man. <laughs> All right, and stop, 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 stop spamming attack fire giant when we're obviously not going to do that. Um, now at this point, let's actually get a physical defensive item. Um, I'm leaning more toward mantle of discord just so we get a little bit more CDR. And um, a little bit more protections. And I think that's going to round out our build. We're not really an offensive uh, mage. Like, mages are usually supposed to be played, I guess. I am more of the fact um, a supporting mage, I guess. Like, healing, stunning, um, dispositioning with my two. Um, I'm not really good at using your ult, unfortunately. But I feel like if I could use your ult, that would, that would be good. That would be great. Um... So at this point, uh, we're just looking for a good decide, and then after the decide, we'll be able to. Merc, no one could stop him. Like Merc is basically like Freya. If you get hit. Hmm. All right. Well, coming out of there. Nice. Hmm. We're good. We're fine. There we go. And now we'll attack Middle Phoenix. And we should be nothing but good here. 
There we go. We got some healing off. God damn it. Come on. We got this. We got this. We got this. We got this. Okay. Mm. Oh, thank you, Kumba. All right. Oh, God. Nope. Back up. Come on. Did I get it? It doesn't seem like I got it. Cool. Um, I'm gonna defend left lane. You guys, you guys do your thing. I'm gonna go ahead and back up. Um, it seems like this Neve is pushing by herself. If so, I should be able to um, take her on, no problem. Um, but we can't have them take a phoenix. We just we just can't give them that inch, you know. And we should probably ward a little bit more. I've been kind of lazy with my warding this game. I I can't lie. And this game has probably gone way too long, to be honest. Um, this game should have probably been over by this point. Uh, we are we do have two phoenix down, and aside from that, um, man, I have so much HP. And aside from that, uh, we're just, I'm pretty sure, yeah, all of us are basically at full build, except for Scylla, it seems. And I'm, what, a tier off? So, we'll go ahead and do this. And we'll follow around this Merc and just kind of support him. Make sure he stays alive. Heal him. Stun. Do stuff for him. Hmm. Whoop. Never, ever getting okay. Well, I was hoping to get that one off. Um, even if I hit that one, I don't think Merc... I don't know, Merc maybe could have killed her quick enough to actually um, not let her backflip. Oh, man. That freaking damage. Look at how fast this Merc is just destroying this thing. All right, there we go. And it seems like we're attacking the right Phoenix. So here we go. Nope, it seems like we're going after the Scylla. Oh, that was a bad miss. That sucks. Come on. Mm. Nice. Wow. That Merc probably hit like the biggest crit ever. And while I didn't have that many kills, you can see that I actually mashed Kumba in assist. So that's the way I like to play Aphrodite. I'm pretty sure this wasn't the most exciting match by any nature, but at the same time, it wasn't that bad. Um, this is kind of how you support Aphrodite. If you're looking for offensive Aphrodite, you might want to check Rain King's channel. Good friend of mine, posts really good content, and he's probably way better Afro than I am because I'm not a big Afro player. I do love this skin, though. I do love this skin. I love her voice pack more than anything. Um, let's check our damage. You can see that, wow, actually, hmm, this Uyir and Merc, Merc was obviously going to be the biggest candidate to have the most damage, um, Uyir followed behind, he is a hunter made to do damage, uh, I'm actually surprised that Scylla didn't do more, much damage, I was like right behind her, and this Kumba, I'm not sure if we, if me and Scylla did a little damage, and Ku or if Kumba had a lot of damage, if that makes sense, um, Wards, I had five, the most placed by a person, a single person, is six. So I wasn't that far behind in warding, yet I should have warded all game. I did not do that. That's my bad. Um, you should always ward. Ward as often as you can. Um, 
let's see, player damage, do, 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 structure damage, Merc obviously took most of that, uh, Scylla helped as well, and Uyr, you know, whatever. Um, player healing, 10,000 player healing, that's not nothing, or that's nothing to laugh at. Um, our team being able to stay in the fight longer or just roam around the jungle longer instead of having to back to get that, that HP back helped us be aggressive, it helped us stay on point, and helped us kind of get these uh, 3v1, 3v2 uh, matchups and that we ended up winning, and that ended up winning the game for us. So, there's that. Uh, let's see, I think that's it. Um, if you want to go into a more offensive afro, obviously you want to probably build into Doth. Doth is a damaging item. Or if you want to keep uh, Warlocks, you go uh, Warlocks, choose a focus for CDR. I still recommend getting Rod, uh, just because it allows you to heal your um, the healing and health regeneration of allies within 70 units is increased by 25%. So if you hit, if they're close to you and you use your three to heal them, 25% on top of your heal, which is already fantastic. Uh, Ethereal Staff might not be a bad idea. I did build a more bulky um, Aphrodite, so it did kind of go well with my build, uh, but. Borak or maybe a Mantle Discord would be all the defense you probably would need. Unless you want to build some physical defense, uh, which you might want to build like Hyde. That will give you the HP and the physical physical and magical protections. Or you could go into um, Mantle Discord, which will give you CDR, magical, and physical protection. Um, lastly, I would add maybe like a Soul Reaver into this. Or actually, the one thing I was really missing was Pen. So add a Spear of... Um, Spear of the Magus or um, Obsidian Shard, and that will give you the pen. Uh, because as you can see, Ymir, Borak, physical, magical defense, and Spirit Robe. Uh, it seemed like, yeah, Jankui didn't build any, didn't build any, didn't build any. Okay, never mind. Ymir was the only one that had magical defense, so you might have, might have wanted to go into Spear then, since there's not a lot of, uh, there's not a lot of pen that you would need. Anyways, I hope you enjoyed. Um, I know it wasn't the most exciting video, but I hope you either learned from my mistakes or got something from this video. Anyways, hope you enjoyed. If you did, subscribe here to utl.com slash me and I will buy it for more of my content. Like the video, it helps out a great deal. Um, comment down below, tell me what your thoughts, what your build for Aphrodite is, and like always, thank you so much. Thank you so very much for watching. My mouth is really dry at this point. Um, thanks so very much for watching. Hope you're having a fantastic day. I'll see you on the next one. Later!